69 here, Coffee Tech 2013. I'm at the Cooler Master booth where I managed to get someone to tell us uh, what we're looking at today. Hi guys, I'm Nick and uh, welcome to the Cooler Master booth. I'm going to introduce you uh, our new product this year. And you can see this case, it's our new Cosmos SE. And all the um, parts inside the cases are new stuff. Right here you can see the iceberg. This is a liquid cooling and German design. And uh, this is our V-series power supply. And also you can see the case. It can install uh, radiators like 240 and 120 and 360 radiators. So this is very cool case and all the components right here are very um, uh, the, the, the products we're gonna focus this year so very cool and it's cool. all red stuff thank you let's move along and take a look at some of the radiators right here you can see the new radiator this is uh, 120 radiators but you got two 120 radiators so the performance is better than uh, 240 millimeter radiators so this is our new stuff and you can install three fans right here there's the fan right here and also you can install extra two fans what's the name of that one it's a uh, side and 120d oh. it's a uh, concept uh, just like the sandwich and right here we have a bigger radiator because normally uh, you guys know 120 and 240 millimeter radiator but we got a bigger this is 140 and this is 280 and this is the new stuff called napton And right here you can see all the air cooler. This is our uh, V8 GTS, really fancy and very cool. But um, you can see this compatible with uh, all the cases and it's not uh, gonna uh, stuck your memory or something. Do you have any new fans this year? Yeah, this is the, our new fan, Jet Flow. You can see four different colors and very good airflow. And you got the rubber. Nice. Very nice and yeah. white. high-end stuff in the small case very good and this is our N series cases with N2 200 it's a micro ATX uh, case a nice little case nice little case and you can install all the stuff right here and this is our um, 693 And the uh, Silencio 352. It's a very good case. You can just open the, the front panel. So instead of coming up with the giant Cosmo 2 this time, you. The the giant Cosmo 2. <laughs> we do the small cases this year and then show all the, uh, like all the small cases, you can install all the high end components. Seems like with the, the Intel Gen 4 chips, everyone's thinking small these days. Yeah, that's right. That's good. Yeah. But you also got the good. Uh, Thermal uh, solution. All right. Nice red. Next here is all our gaming gears with the keyboard, mouse, and everything. And you can see the keyboard. She lost angry birds. Shot by enemies. Poor, poor little girl, she got team killed, right? Is that what you guys are talking about? No. No? Oh. Cry. Say hi to overclock.net. I'm dying. Oh, that's so sad. I know lots of people want to help you. <laughs> Alright, let's take a look at the other side. So, we're very familiar with the Cooler Master keyboards. I seem to have zoomed in. Uh, we're very familiar with your keyboards. We all love your keyboards. I actually own a, a quick fire in, red, in the red switch. Uh, what do you have new for Coffee Dicks this year? Uh, yeah. 
Uh, we just launched the Quickfire Steels and uh, uh, the XC is following. And then uh, each of the, our keyboard provides uh, at least uh, three kind of switches. Yeah. And uh, the most uh, the most embarrassing is the TK. We sell very well in America, especially US and uh, in Europe. Yeah. I know. I do. TK is a nice looking keyboard. What can you yeah. tell me about here? The the uh, XL. Is that just a quick fire that with the 10 key added on? XL. Uh, uh, XT. Sorry. XT. My, my oh, bad, sorry. My uh, bad. Oh, sorry. Uh, the, yeah. The, this. Um, uh, uh, like, like, what, like what I talk about. It is, uh, we provide uh, uh, blue, red, brown, and uh, green switch. You know, uh, from the softer uh, to the hardest green switch. Yep. Yeah. And uh, each uh, each uh, uh, each XT uh, features uh, a very durable PCB PCB board embedded inside. I mean, a steel plated a, a steel plate board, and. Uh, uh, of course, uh, uh, the wind lock and uh, multimedia shortcut, and, uh, and, and it is is uh, better than uh, our TK and uh, Quickfire Ultimate. Yeah, uh, include the ultimate. There, I'm actually not focused on that yet. Ultimate uh, is uh, almost uh, actually is almost the same as uh, our Quickfire Pro, but uh, it's uh, full backline. Yeah, four backlines, four LED backlines. Yes. And the rest almost the same. The rest almost the same. Yeah, almost the and same. there's the TK that we're very familiar with on overclock.net. Uh -huh. Very highly recommended keyboard for us. Uh -huh. And there's the new XT. XT, and uh, and we just launched uh, up there this, uh, uh, last month. This the quick fire well. sales, yeah. So. Uh, as you can see, uh, we we make it uh, we make it side printed keycaps. Okay, yeah. I have a hard question for you now. <laughs> if, if, if I own a quick fire, can uh -huh. I buy a set of stealth keycaps and convert it over to the stealth? Uh, what 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 do you say? I told you it's a hard question. Right? <laughs> yeah. I I actually own two quick fire keyboards. Okay. I own a red and I own a brown. Okay. So I would I would very much like to switch one of them over at least to to a stealth. Uh -huh. I don't have to buy a whole new stealth keyboard. If you could sell me the stealth keycaps, <laughs> I would be I would be delighted. So you're not gonna you're not gonna get into selling keycaps at all. No, not not especially uh, provide uh, keycaps. But uh, uh, tell your marketing guys there's there's a big market. <laughs> okay, for, we will for, try. For <laughs> we will uh, try. Uh, different color keycaps that you can get into that sort of thing. I know uh, a lot of people have asked where can I buy different color keycaps, different language yeah. layout keycaps. We just want a set of keycaps. We don't have to buy a whole new keyboard. Uh yes, but uh, yeah, we are planning to uh, sell a uh, special keycap with different color or different height. Yeah, we, we are planning. And uh, but uh, now uh, we have uh, you, you know the normal keyboard, normal keycap, and uh, sampling keycap, and uh, we'll and we will we are going to launch another key, keyboard with uh, blank keycap. You know, totally blank. To totally, yeah, blank. totally blank. A taco board. <laughs> Well, thank you very much. Oh, I guess she's winning. <laughs> Are you winning or did you die? You <laughs> 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 four. Four kills. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to Disneyland. <laughs> All right. Now we can come over here to the power supply. Uh oh. Series includes 700, 850, and 1000 watts. And we're showing uh, all the components inside the V series, which we use all the high quality stuff. Right here, first you can see the Japanese capacitor. 
and also we also uh, we also use the Japanese solid capacitor here. And 42 millimeter transformer. This one. And right here we have a custom DC 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 to DC module. And this is a special design which um, provide the better efficiency. Right here you can see the flat cable for easy cable management and the new fan which is long life and very silent which is the FDB fan. Ooh, blue dynamic, yeah, everyone loves blue, blue dynamic, dynamic fan. fan. That's a big one right there. That's a big one. Oh, it's a new I bearing, got... good bearing fan. You got me there, I love blue dynamic fans. Nice. We're fans of fans on OCA. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you can see the very uh, good coating, coating on the V. Zoom out. Okay. And this is a fully modular system. Very nice. Did you say what the the plus rating was on that on this? Oh, it's a 80 plus gold certified. Very good. And right here we are showing two identical system with the. Uh, Two 80 plus gold certified power supply, but they are different brands. It's our V series, and this is the uh, uh, other brand 80 plus gold power supply. Let me show you. Get it power on, and I'll show you the difference between those two. They are identical. Use the same motherboard, CPU, VGA card. Everything is the same. Just. The power supply is different. And now it's booting. Okay, you can see under the same condition, the same voltage, the same current, but they got the different wattage, which means uh, you can see this is the idle mode system. You didn't, you don't use any like 100% um, uh, loading or playing games, but it's just idle mode. Okay. And usually 80 plus gold test, and you got the 80 plus gold certified with a 20%, 50%, and 100% loading. But people never test that under 20%. So we're just showing under 20%. We still got the uh, high efficiency. You see the wattage. Other brand power supply got 76. Yes. And our power difference. supply 55. So it's a big difference. What are, uh, tell me what are the, the three numbers on each of those if some people don't know. Oh, on top, this is one, uh, 155 volts, uh, 115 volts. It's just the uh, so AC that's the wall, direct. that's the wattage from the wall, uh, the uh, voltage from, from the wall. From the so wall. It's, it's so uh, everyone got the same. 110 volt yeah. system, okay. Yeah. yeah. But and it's actually 115. Uh, <laughs> 115. That's good. Uh, and uh, uh, current, it's a power supply, just the amp. Power supply provide the amp to the motherboard. So that's the DC the current DC from the current, power supply yeah, to the motherboard. We're looking at 50 and uh, almost 70 it was for a while on the other one. The wattage? Yeah. And what's the bottom number? The wattage. Oh, that's the number. wattage. Yeah. That's a significant difference for an idle system. Yeah. So this one's just system. sitting there. It's burning. Yeah, it's burning and then uh, spend more wattage. So you, you're using more. Uh, electricity. Which so, means, so that competitor system is just throwing your money away. Yeah. Every time it's sitting that's there. That's right. That's right. It's throwing away your money. That's right. Curse them. <laughs> <laughs> so ours got better. All right. That's Kip69 here at the Cooler Master booth, Computex 2013. Thank you very much for your for your time today. Thank you.